Hey everybody, I'm in beautiful Torbay today. Before we start our hike, I'm just going to turn around here so you can check out the amazing mural behind me depicting some of the history of Torbay. The mural was painted by Korean Canadian visual artist Gunok Song in 2017. So let's head to the beach. We will be hiking today from Big Beach in Torbay up to the beach memorial site. For those of you who aren't familiar with the town, Torbay is located on the Avalon Peninsula of Newfoundland and Labrador, right on the Atlantic Ocean, as you can see right here. I'm just going to head over to these benches here for a quick sit to enjoy the gorgeous view. Torbay is home to many cliffs and coves. Looking to the right, there's Jesse's Cove, Whalen's Cove, Powers Cove inside, Powers Cove outside, Ryan's Cove, and you can see the top of Sculpin Rock. Now I'm going to go over to the bridge and start making my way up the path. You can see the river running to the right of the bridge. Many locals call it Main River. I'm told that in years past, local children used to play hockey on the river in the winter and catch eels there in the summer. Tanator Bay is home to a couple of conservation areas. Down by the beach where we are is the Shoreline Conservation Area. You can find out more about the municipal habitat stewardship areas on the torbay.ca website under the Planning and Development Department. It is beautiful weather here today. You can hear the sound of the water on the beach. There's nothing like the sound of the water bubbling over the stones. If you look out, you can see that gorgeous blue sky stretching out to the water. There's some cloud cover today, but overall the sky is pretty still. Now if you look over the water to the left, you can spy at Tapper's Cove, where local fishermen launch their boats. It's home to the Torbay Harbor Authority. Could turn back around here now. Take a look at all of these beautiful beach stones. Let's head up the path to the beach memorial site now. It's a bit of a rocky path, so make sure you wear appropriate footwear if you decide to take this little hike. going to pause here for a second and looking up to my right you can spot Codner Falls. Just to the left of that you can see a little lookout spot which is great for taking in the falls. If you want to go to that lookout just take the path to the right of the bridge rather than the left which is the one we are on now. The great thing about this hike is that throughout the walk you always have the beautiful beach and ocean to look at, at your, on your left there. As you walk higher you can really get a nice panoramic view of the beach. So we're coming up on the beach memorial site there now. This is a pretty short hike and it's not overly strenu strenuous. Plus the bonus is you get to take in all these amazing sights and sounds along the way. There is some beautiful stonework around the memorial. And we've got a few large stone steps coming up here that will take you right up to the memorial.
when you get to the top, you can take a rest on these benches. I'm just going to go over and sit down here and just look at that view. You really can sit here and take it all in. Just going to get up here now and if I take a few more steps, we can look at the memorial plaque. Torbay received a designation as the site of a National Historic Event in 1952 by the Historic Sites and Monuments Board of Canada because it was the location of the landing of British forces in 1762 prior to the Battle of Signal Hill. The plaque reads, As the Seven Years' War drew to a close in 1762, the Comte de Hazenville led a final French attack on Newfoundland, seizing St. John's. When word of the loss reached the British in New York, preparations were at once begun to retake the place. A military force commanded by Colonel William Amherst was dispatched to Newfoundland, supported by a blockading fleet from under Admiral Lord Colville. The British forces landed here at Torbay on the 13th of September and proceeded overland to St. John's, which they forced the French to surrender five days later. And that is our hike from Big Beach in Torbay to the Beach Memorial site. Thanks, everybody, for joining me. And you know what? If you're in the area, this is really a great spot to enjoy being a tourist at home. And for all those unable to visit this year, I really hope you enjoyed this virtual hike and this little taste of beautiful Torbay. <laughs>